This is a brief video demonstration of how to use the QWERTY keyboard, Bluetooth QWERTY keyboard, with voiceover on the iPad. You notice on the screen right now the current position is on settings. Uh, these are all apps where they refer to them as items on the screen. You have a dock on the bottom with four of the most currently used um, apps on the iPad. Uh, before we get started, the uh, VO keys on the keyboard are the control option on the lower left. And we'll be using the arrow keys and some select letters to uh, read the whole screen or read from the current position. To go ahead and open an app, you can do it two, one of two ways. The up and down arrow keys at the same time, or the VO and spacebar will do the same thing. To go ahead and get out of uh, an app or to close it, um, it's VO or control option H. If you do control option H twice, it goes ahead and brings up uh, all the apps that are running in the background and you can move between them with hitting uh, the right or left arrow keys. So we'll be demonstrating uh, all these things. Now to go to the top of the screen from where we are right now, from the settings up to calendar on the upper left, we push uh, control up arrow. Calendar, Friday, December 05. Double tap to open. Now we go ahead and we move to the next item by hitting the uh, right arrow key. Face time. No, photos. A little bit slow because of the open. video recording right now. Reminders. Box. It'll be faster Photos. when you do it. FaceTime. So I'm using my left Double arrow key to go to the previous, and Photos. I'm using the right arrow Double to box. go to the next. And I want to go to the bottom of the screen right now to where uh, Safefire is, and so I'll push uh, Control down arrow. Dog. Safari. And it takes me Double down there. Open. Now I want to go ahead and push the uh, Control up arrow to get to the very top position calendar. Calendar. Friday, December 05. Now, if I want to go ahead and open that particular, I'd say, the calendar, I push the up and down arrow at the same time, or Control Option uh, Spacebar. And of course, calendar. there you see the calendar. Now, they refer to uh, uh, certain areas of the screen by container and uh, the individual items on the screen. So where we are right now, the menu is also referred to as containers. Button. And I'm using my right arrow to go ahead and navigate Selected. across button. that. Button. Yeah. Button. Four off. Now Search. later we'll talk button. more yeah. about when we want to input four. data. So you'll, uh, we, we have the button. nav keys button. on automatically, and the nav keys are your right and left arrow. So if you push them together at the same time, listen. Quick nav off. It says quick nav off. I'll push it again. Quick nav off. Yeah. So you must have the uh, nav keys off, or the left and right arrow key pushed down once to hear nav keys off before you can input really any data like in word processing if you want to do any writing. Okay, now to get out of this we do uh, control option H and that will take us uh, take us out of it. It just closed right now. Calendar, Friday, December 05. If I wanted to get into Double the active open. apps uh, all we do is hit uh, control H twice. App switcher. And, we, and we get Friday. into the actively Swing running uh, apps. And by hitting the left arrow or right arrow, I can go ahead and I can navigate. I can navigate through these. Okay, I'm going to close that for right now. Control Option or V O H, and that will close it. Now we're back at the uh, Calendar, menu. Friday, December 05. Now to go ahead, and, to go ahead and read uh, all those items on the screen, and we won't do it now because of time. But it's the VO keys B will read all those items on there automatically one after another. To stop that process, just hit right or left arrow once. Uh, to go ahead and read from the current position, say I was down on, um, I was say at uh, a photo booth and I wanted to read only those items to the bottom of the page, I do VO A keys. Calendar, Friday, December 05. 